And thank you, Stefan, for joining us. Much appreciated. Turkey, Luxembourg, Lithuania, and Faroe Islands. What's your first reaction to the draw? I think uh, Lithuania will be the first uh, match we will play against them. So this is, I think, all the time a good uh, um, something new, something interesting. If you have not been in this uh, in the country and uh, you did not know the squad, so this is interesting. Um, of course, uh, um, Farrer. Uh, I think it's, it was one uh, match, a friendly match. So it's an interesting uh, country. Um, and yeah, from my side, you know, I'm living maybe 50 kilometers away from Luxembourg. This is my, my, where my hometown is. So it is uh, very close to my own hometown. But I also know that they uh, developed very good in this uh, Luxembourg football in last years, uh, not only national team, also some clubs. And so, yeah, it's, uh, I'm satisfied. It's good. With the, the quality in your squad, would it be fair to say that Turkey are favourites for this group and to win this group? Um, maybe from outside, yes. Uh, and also our, our goal will be to finish at first in this group. Um, but this means not that we don't have respect. It, it, uh, it's only, uh, you know, if we go on the pitch, we want to win. It's your first experience, I think, of the UEFA Nations League as a coach. How much are you looking forward to it? And what challenges do you think it will bring? Um, there are a lot of new challenges since, since I've been a Turkish national coach and a lot of first times. So, um, of course, you were watching it. And, um, of course, from German uh, view, um, but now I, I know that um, Turkey uh, goes down to this uh, Group C. And um, yeah, I think first it is the sportive uh, goal, which we want to reach, uh, that we want to go up again in Group B. And uh, then um, it is, it's, it's time to de develop us as a team. And um, this means also, for example, concentration, uh, trying to to create new tactic or formations or something like that. Maybe also giving some new players a chance um, because in our backhead is definitely uh, then, I hope it will be also a world champion, um, but definitely also qualification for 2024. Um, so I'm really satisfied about this uh, uh, kind of uh, challenge. You mentioned that the aims and objectives are to try and try and win the group and go up to League B, as you said. Um, there are lots of fantastic and very exciting young players. Will you be giving them a chance to show what they can do on a on an, on the Nations League stage? Mm. Okay. In the in the end, it, it it's it's a topic of quality and not young player or old player, but definitely um, in the uh, since I'm there. I think uh, six players did their first uh, match for Turkey and five of them were born 98 and younger. So, of course, you can uh, recognize something, but we will not uh, bring uh, young players only to bring young players into the team because um, we want to build up, uh, of course, a kind of uh, a team skeleton uh, where, where the players are used to play with each other. And so... Definitely the young players have a big chance, but it's up to them to bring a great performance in the Turkish or in, in the national leagues. Fantastic. Thank you so much. Have a, have a, lovely, have a lovely Christmas as well. Enjoy, yeah, the, yeah, enjoy the festive. Period. Yes, yes. And uh, happy, happy New Year. Thank you very much. Cheers, Stefan. Take care. Joker, see you on Saturday. Huh? See, you, see you on Saturday, coach. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you, yeah. coach. Thanks bye a bye. lot.